Hey guys, I just came back from Montgomery and see what I found. My hand, my buff Uppington, has hatched some of her eggs and now we have baby chicks. Rami's here. Uh, I've built this temporary brooder for the chickies and he loves his chicks and this one has got a mama hen. Normally, I buy chicks from the store, but this time I decided to let her hatch some so we didn't have to spend some money. So I've just fed them hard boiled eggs that I've ground. And Mama Hen is teaching her baby chicks how to eat. That chick is eating a piece of hay. There we go. You don't want to eat that hay. Teaching her babies. See, there's a couple more. I think we have about seven that I've counted so far. So I'll show you. So I'm in my hen house. This is my X pen. I've just built a temporary brooder. And uh, Rami's here, and I'm inviting him in. Rami, come in. Good boy. Be gentle. That's good. You got baby cheeks, Rummy? Yeah. Hmm? Oh, I'm gonna close the door. Yeah, it's good. That's good. That's your baby cheeks. Is that your baby cheeks? Yeah. Yeah, look at it. They're having a little lunch, huh? You're gonna lick them. Your baby cheeks, Rummy. Rummy, sit. Good boy. What I like to do is try to do it for every single chick too, not just one. Oh. Check the butt. Make sure the chicks are not plucked up with poop at the end. Because if it's completely plucked up, they'll die. There's no way to express the poop. So, by and by, little by little, she he wants to lick them. Um, by and by, the chicks start getting used to him and having the dogs visit. <laughs> it's pretty neat how you watch a mama hen teach her baby chicks how to eat. That's why I make sure that I shred the eggs really, really, really tiny with a blender. Cut it really, really, chop it up really tiny. And she feeds it, she eats it, and she makes a little sound to make her baby chicks come out. They're all under her. And Rami is of course here keeping us company. I like to pet chicken, make her feel loved and assured, and she's safe, and she's happy, and she's cooing. So here I am with Rami, and we are doing a little bit of familiarization exercises between the chicks and Rami, and he's right here. The mama hen is just feeding right now, she's eating some food. And he's just showing curiosity, and that's good. And what I normally do is I take the chicks, he's really interested, he's sticking his nose right under mama, and then I present the chick to him. The chicks get a good look, and he gets a good look and a good sniff. Isn't that cute, Rami Cup? Look at the baby chick. And I use this opportunity to feed the chick a little bit of water because sometimes they're quite dumb. You have to stick them their beak into the water. So I normally stick the head in a little bit so they get a little drink. So interested. 
He, de he never ever hurts them. He loves them. And that's how I train him to bond with the chicks. And you'll notice he's trying to nurse them. He tries to lick them. And the mama hen is not bothered at all. She's not stressed out. Because she was raised like that too. It is so cute. Oh, look at the baby chickies. They're now just starting to feed. They're coming out. They're eating. I got raw gel. A little bit of minced meat, shredded carrots, and dried worms, all there. So Mama can have some, replenish her, her own nutrition, and the chicks can have some too. He's licking them. He's licking the chicks. Ah, oh, Rami, you love your chickies. Sometimes you see the mom, mama hen actually shove the chicks toward the food bowl when they don't seem to get the hint. And she's trying to teach them how to eat. That's cute. Baby chicks. That's the sound she makes when she's trying to teach them. There's food, there's food. Come and get food. That's what she's saying. When she hear that her sound changes. And Rami's kind of in the way. He's hovering right above the chicks. <laughs> and when I'm done with the exercise, I tell him it's time to go. Huh, Rami? I'm gonna leave the chickies, let them eat. Alright, and then that's the game. Alright, it's time to go. Let's go. Yes. Thank you. That's a good boy. There we go. And that's the chickies. And they can rest. Tomorrow we'll come and see them again.